So the question of the day is shaken or stirred? <laughs> hey everybody, Ricky here with Apple Valley Farm. Today I'm going to answer a question that I get all the time about stain. People ask me all the time, can I just shake my can of stain or do I really have to stir it? That's a great question. Obviously, you need to do something to it because we all know, common sense says, all those sediments sink in there. And so you, you would think, hey, if I shake it up pretty vigorously, that should be good enough, right? Well, I've got this can of stain that's been sitting for a couple of weeks. So I'm shaking it here right now. Let's open it up. Let's take a look and see. All right, one last shake. Let's open it up. And this is uh, a gallon can of Verathane Dark Walnut, which is kind of my go-to stain. All right, it's about two-thirds of the way full. Now, I'm just gonna, it looks like it's mixed pretty well. I'm gonna take the stick, this is just an old scrap piece, and I'm gonna drag it along the bottom just a little bit, and let's see if it picks up any sediment. Oh my goodness. Look at that. That. <laughs> ah. Now that is what did not get mixed up in the shaking. Oh my gosh. So, ask me again. Can I just shake my stain or do I need to stir it? Yee. Okay, a pretty definitive answer to the question, can I just shake my stain or do I have to stir it? I think that answers the question pretty boldly. You should definitely stir your stain every time you use it because those sediments do sink down and they do get compacted down at the bottom of the can. When you have a big can like this gallon can right here, it's even worse. So you definitely want to stir it if possible every time you use it. If not, I mean, you're not really getting the full color complement of the stain as it was intended to be. Hey, I hope that helps a lot. Thanks a lot for being here. If you like this video, then like this video. Please give us a thumbs up. And if you like stuff like this, we're doing things like this all the time. So please subscribe to our channel. We would love to have you here on a regular basis. Thanks a lot. And again, I hope that helped. Take care. Have a great day. And I'll see you next time.